coming up. The premium for Akaushi is all the difference between breaking even and making a profit. The demand is greater than any of us can keep up with, so there's tons of room for more breeders to come in. Hear the story of Akaushi cattle and their positive effects on the beef industry, next on The American Rancher. Hello and welcome to The American Rancher. I'm Pam Minnick. On this episode, we're focusing on the proven success of Akaushi cattle, a Wagyu breed from Japan that's now proudly known as the American Akaushi. The expectations of American beef consumers are very high. Across the country, butcher shop owners, doctors, award-winning chefs, and supermarket executives affirm that the Akaushi breed exceeds those expectations. A lot of people have heard the term Wagyu, and Wagyu means Japanese cow. It's country of origin. And uh, we, we embrace the term Wagyu because it means Japanese cow, of which Akaushi is a specific breed. All Akaushi are Wagyu, but not all Wagyu is Akaushi. Kroger spent a lot of time redefining the grocery experience, and we're committed to providing friendly service and the freshest possible beef in town. The flavor of Akiusha beef is great. Uh, it has a rich buttery flavor and our customers that have been able to have it too echo those comments as well. The diets of Americans are constantly changing. So we look for customers that shop in other areas to kind of bridge over and look for different offerings inside beef commodity or different categories. That's why we're so excited selling premium Akiusha beef. Over the years, I've learned a lot about the beef business, and the marbling is what sells the beef. But that's what my customers wanted. They wanted the marbling. I, I remember the very first day we cut into the super well marbled piece of Akaushi rib. I was stunning. It was intensely well marbled, uh, great flavor, great color, uh, cuts very well, and then it has the taste to match. So a lot of times you'll see stuff that's insanely well marbled and it doesn't have the taste to back it up, but every single time, Akaushi has that profile. People buy with their eyes almost 90% of the time. They wanna see, they wanna come in, they wanna see a very beautiful marble piece of meat. Uh, that Akaushi marbling is second to none. Especially with Akaushi, all the health benefits associated with it, higher monounsaturated fats, higher counts of oleic acid. The trend for beef is definitely eating less, but eating more responsible beef. So that's what we're very excited for teaching consumers and it seems that that's where our customer base is focused on. What we serve at Tris is a globally sourced seafood in Texas steak. I mean, it's, it's that simple. The next generation wants to know where their food came from, what they're eating, how it was raised, and, and was there integrity in that whole process from the ranch all the way to the plate. And I think Akaushi is leading that way currently and have been for a while with the DNA testing of knowing what their genetic is. You go to a restaurant, you have a bad steak, it was maybe it was cooked perfectly, and you're like, oh, it, didn't, it wasn't tender, I can make a better one at home. Well, that's because of lack of marbling and serving a lower grade pr program and trying to charge a lot of money for it. In my mind, there's the right genetic makeup and really understanding how to utilize that Wagyu genetic properly you get a beefy steak that you'll never forget. And there's nobody that's gonna say, I can make a better one at home. We serve ribeye, tenderloin, and 60 day dry aged strip. We use salt, pepper, garlic, and we, we focus on the crust, getting the Maillard. The Maillard reaction is a natural sugars in the protein caramelizing, that's the creation of browning. This breed is the most consistent for sure. So putting this, this genetic into your breed is a no-brainer in my opinion. I've watched that as a consumer as on, the, on the plate level for years. The only reason any of us do this is the end result, and that's the guest paying for that steak. Akaushi provides that beef eating ex experience uh, more consistently than any program, and I've eaten all of them. And I've stood behind it for years, and I can assure you putting this genetic in your herd will make a huge difference for the, for the end game. And without getting too technical, the Akaoshi beef, it's the most unique beef in the world. First of all, it has high concentrations of what's called MUFA, monounsaturated fatty acids. 
There are good fatty acids and there are bad fatty acids. The, the saturated fatty acids are the bad ones. The unsaturated, like the monounsaturated fatty acids, that's the good fatty acids. That's found in high quantities in Akoshi beef. In, in addition, the American Heart Association does recommend uh, a diet high in protein and in this monounsaturated fat. That's not all. There's also a substance called CLA, conjugated linoleic acid. When we consume that, it actually helps our immune system. So again, you've got the best tasting beef on the planet combined with the healthiest beef on the planet. That's a winning combination. And all the different cuts of beef have the same health qualities from the hamburger meat all the way up to the steaks. We've got four restaurants here in Fort Worth, Texas. Fawn Hills Fine Texas Cuisine, specializing in as many Texas farm-to-table products as we can get. I come from a ranch and family, and we've, we've tried a lot of steaks, a lot of beef, and I went through as many different programs as we could find. The Akiyushi has been the best product, the best, most consistent, best tasting, best to deal with that we can find in the whole state of Texas. Now this is what we like, it's a beautiful meat, it's got an incredible texture to it, it holds its own. Look at the marbling, that's what we look for. I want texture and I want marbling. When it comes to premium beef, everybody knows prime choice, select, that kind of stuff. But when it comes to the high end, once you get above prime, Akiyushi is the greatest word I can use right now. It's absolutely handcrafted, really impressive beef. It's got a flavor that's buttery, that's got that olive oil kind of flavor, it's incredible. Once you get to the high end of steaks, Akiyushi is where it's at. Up next. We needed to go with a breed that we knew could produce that high marbling and that high premium meat every single time very consistently. See how ranchers are taking advantage of the demand for Akiyushi beef. More on that after the break here on The American Rancher. This is hard brand cattle. Family owned, family run, prime focused and home to the largest and best source for Akushi genetics in the world. U.S. commercial cattlemen are buying our bulls because they work. If you raise Akushi cattle, we have a buyback program. Our cattle grade 45% USDA prime, less than 2% select, averaging a 2.8 yield grade. It's time you earn premiums over commodity prices. Akushi provides beef customers with the best beef eating experience. Visit us at heartbrandcattle.com. Introducing Vitalix Feedlot Starter Tubs, formulated for beef calves before and after weaning to help decrease pull rates and stress while increasing saliva. Feedlot Starter Tubs contain Diamond V Nature Safe, which supports immune strength, antibiotic stewardship, and gut health. They're also packed with a veil of four, a nutrient containing organic zinc, manganese, copper, and cobalt. Vitalix, stretch your profits with every lick. Visit vitalix.com to find out more. Established in 1987, Superior Livestock Auction is the largest cattle marketing network in North America. We sell forward contracted, load lots of ranch fresh cattle on video and internet auctions. Last year, almost 1.4 million head were sold by Superior Livestock Auction, and they brought top dollar. World Champion Auctioneers present your cattle to buyers across the nation. We have over 8,000 active and qualified buyers, maximizing competitive bidding and true price discovery. Your cattle stay at the ranch until delivery, and your superior rep writes you a check when it's done. Simple as that. Our job is getting you the best paycheck possible. We know that most producers only get one paycheck a year for their cattle, and more cattlemen and women trust us to get the most out of every sale. Call us at 800-422-2117 or go online to learn more about how Superior Livestock Auction can work for you. Welcome back to The American Rancher. We just saw the demand for Akaushi beef on the retail and food service side, but now let's hear from ranchers and how they're taking advantage of the breed. Akaushi Genetics increases everyone's operations marketing versatility from selling seed stock to branded beef programs, all of which deliver great premiums for your cattle. I would say 2009 is definitely that aha moment. We were sort of looking on where to branch out. The ranching industry was changing. Started studying what the Akushi were, uh, what the potential was in the breed, where they were gonna go, and it fit us to a T. I was really excited about it. Uh, we came and bought 100 cows and four bulls. 
and that's where it all started from. The demand for high quality food production is there, and I think the more we evolve, the uh, stricter we come with what we're actually gonna consume as a family. So I'm proud of what we're raising for my kids and for the kids of other families that we sell to. The premium for Akaushi is all the difference between breaking even and making a profit. And that's been the key for us as far as, as the growth is it's allowed us to put more money back into it instead of keeping the herd small. And I can't say enough about the, the buyers because they're, they want the cattle. Akaushi is a high fertility breed uh, that, that's adapted very well in the, in the United States, adapted very well uh, here in Central Texas. Uh, but more importantly, what we've kind of seen uh, over the past decade is how they've, they've worked so well uh, with the domestic cattle here in the United States. So when commercial producers uh, introduce Akaushi, generally it's a form of bulls. They buy bulls. Uh, most of the Akaushi bulls range from five to, to 8,000, uh, which is right in line with, with uh, market price for good registered cattle in, in any breed. By using Akaushi bulls on their cow base, they're able to keep all their production the same, yet getting a premium uh, over market to those cattle. We run a cow-calf Akaushi commercial herd. Um, our cow herd is mainly half-bloods or three-quarter bloods Akaushi. We put um, registered Akaushi bulls on them. We knew that we wanted to get a premium for our calf crop, and in order to do that, we needed, um, we needed to go with a breed that we knew could produce that high marbling and that high premium meat every single time very consistently. So as young ranchers, whenever we started out or had the opportunity to start out, we couldn't think of a better breed than to go with the Akushi. The defining moment was I was down in plant in Corpus Christi and saw a set of cattle that were, uh, they were cross of Red Angus and Akushi. And they graded 75% prime. They had no Euro grade fours or fives, uh, which is a key component because if you can minimize that outside fat but still get the marbling, that's, that's the ideal world. And uh, these cattle did all that. And that just said, you know, the, the cattle performed well for the rancher. They were great for the meat packer and absolutely super for the consumer. So it was the best of all worlds and it can change the industry. I, I thought that at the time and feeling is even stronger today. Their vigor, their longevity, their health, the, the breeding end of it, the bulls, how they hold up, how they cover cattle. Uh, these cattle are, are extremely light when they're born and they grow like no other that, that we've been associated with. Not every breed can adapt to weather what we have down there, and we've been very happy um, how well that these cattle, especially the bulls, how they adapt and breed back and stay in such great shape. They shine, they make us shine. Their carcass merit is, is bar none the best I've ever seen. We've been able to ship genetics all over the world, uh, embryos, semen, uh, bulls, and, and live cattle. Uh, so we've shipped these bulls uh, up in, into Canada, Montana, Idaho. Uh, these bulls have been able to adapt to, to many different environments extremely well. Uh, the libido of the bull, uh, the soundness of the Akushi's feet and legs, and the longevity of the bulls uh, has really been impressive uh, and, and been very well accepted by commercial bull buyers. What's really been fun for me to see is the growth of the Akaushi breed. It started out as a small herd, but today we've moved on so far past that. At Heartbrand, we've been very fortunate to grade over 60,000 head of these Akaushi. And of those 60,000, 48% of them have graded USDA Prime and above. We also have a very attractive yield grade, average yield grade of about 2.5. So what's so great about these Akaushi is they put the fat on the inside. They put the fat in as marbling and don't put excessive back fat on. So we've got the Red Brangus, uh, that are American Red Brangus Mamas, that are large frame and the hybrid vigor crossing one breed, Red Brangus, with another breed, Akaushi. The offspring are just beautiful. F1 steer calves, which actually are about 10 months old at this point, they're probably closer to 650, 700 pounds. The heifers are probably 625, 650. Uh, they're heavy. They're really beautiful calves. 
We're at the edge of the Chihuahuan Desert from Mexico. We're an hour from the Mexico border. And it's very sparse, a lot of prickly pear, a lot of mesquite, a lot of coyotes. It's pretty rough. Um, the cattle, we have no issues. They do good in heat, they do good in cold. I actually have never seen a climate that they don't perform in. Our cows breed back in 30 to 45 days. Their productivity is pretty insane. We have low birth weights. We're calving out from like 62 to 75 pounds. The fact that these cattle can go on and perform at the level they do, it just puts them so far above other breeds. And I think if you're going in as a seed stock producer, that's um, a great avenue. There's a lot of room. But also going in as F1 producers, buying the bulls, putting them on whatever I like the Angus crosses, I like the black wagon crosses, those F1s will perform at a higher level than the full blood animals of those other breeds. When people use Akushi genetics, their application is limitless. I mean, some people use Akushi genetics just to increase uh, their fertility, their udder quality, just on the, on the female side. Uh, most producers that use Akushi genetics uh, do to increase their, their bottom line. Uh, we also have guys that, that use Akushi genetics uh, to, to run their own beet program. Uh, and some, some uh, completely see using Akushi increases their marbling uh, regardless of how they finish the cattle, whether it's pasture, uh, whether it's a high, high grain diet. So yeah, those Akushi genetics are, are just so versatile and how people can use them, uh, that's the reason, I mean, it, it's continued to grow. After the break. The biggest opportunity for the beef industry is know what you're raising. We'll see how the Akaushi breed is using technology to find even more success. You're watching The American Rancher. Stay with us. This is Hard Brand Cattle. Family owned, family run, prime focused, and home to the largest and best source for Akaushi genetics in the world. U.S. commercial cattlemen are buying our bulls because they work. If you raise Akaushi cattle, we have a buyback program. Our cattle grade 45% USDA prime, less than 2% select, averaging a 2.8 yield grade. It's time you earn premiums over commodity prices. Akaushi provides beef customers with the best beef eating experience. Visit us at heartbrandcattle.com. Reproductive success is critical in every profitable cow-calf operation. That's why you need effective, easy breeding with Vitafirm Concept Aid. High concentrations of organic trace minerals and vitamin E found in Concept Aid will ensure more of your cows breed back faster. Plus, you'll be giving your herd the Amifirm advantage, leading to healthier, heavier, more uniform calves at weaning. Vitafirm Concept Aid. Effective, easy breeding. The Superior Country Page is the leading online marketplace for buying and selling load lots of calves, feeders, and breeding stock. The Country Page is an efficient, easy to use, and low cost solution for selling cattle. You set the price and move at your pace with flexible delivery options. The Country Page matches the best buyers to the best sellers at the best price for both parties. Call or log on today to find out more about the Superior Country Page. Welcome back to the American Rancher. The future of the beef industry is in the hands of ranchers across America, and a successful future is based on data. The growth of the American Akaushi Association is proof of how much traceability and data really do matter. We are definitely excited about the future because of the growth in the premium meat market and whether you're raising any breed of cattle. The key is gonna be quality in the future quality and traceability. I have been working with the Akaushi Association for the last four years, five years. With your membership, you get digital beef, which I highly encourage everybody to use because you can track each cow, each calf, how productive the cow is. We knew that we wanted to get a premium for our calf crop. And in order to do that, we needed to go with the breed that we knew could produce that high marbling and that high premium meat every single time very consistently. And we do that with using a lot of the American Akaushi Association and the research behind it and with the tools and the accessibility of digital beef and all that information of the EPDs and the low birth weight bulls, which is really important for us with the young herd and also a lot of first time heifers. 
Having someone who DNA verifies the lineage of your cattle is extremely important. The American Akaushi Association is the only association I know of that proves DNA verification for a branded beef program. And having that ability to have that many animals going into a branded beef program that have quality data, that have yield grade data, that have growth data, that have been DNA verified provides great value to have large numbers of data to back up the Akaushi breed of cattle. Uh, every year you want to be progressive, you want to make a better product, you want to make better cows, and you want to make better beef to help your entire industry. Uh, I, I think using Akaushi genetics uh, increases the palatability and the healthiness of beef all over the world regardless of how they use it. This is the age of data, well, without a doubt. So if you look at normal cattle production, the people that raise cows are not the same guys selling meat. If you look at pork or, or chicken or eggs or any of, any of those uh, types of, of animal protein, the people that raise the animals are the ones that sell that product. And, and beef is, is the most segregated. So I, I think that is the biggest opportunity for the beef industry is know what you're raising. The Akushi, from a business point of view, put us in a unique position to where there is a demand for a product that's DNA certified. And the Akushi Association specifically allow, you know, tracks this data and how it keeps the science and the business data readily available at our fingertips. It is 100% certified Akayushi, yes we are, because we have DNA to prove it, which I don't think there is any other commercial breed that actually has a database like that. And it's a lot of work, and I commend the association for really keeping up. They are very easy to deal with, well run. They run it very efficiently, backed by science, and um, honestly. My role here with the association is to oversee day-to-day -day operations, which include DNA submission, cattle registrations, and member services. The American Akaushi Association is a unique, continuously growing, and constantly improving registered breed association for full-blood, purebred, and percentage Akaushi cattle. We require DNA verification on every animal we register to ensure buyers' confidence in the animals they buy and to open the door of opportunity for breeders through branded beef buyback programs. The American Akushi Association sets itself apart from other associations by not focusing on only one portion of the beef industry, but instead focusing on providing a complete program from conception to consumer. Ultimately, the American Akaushi Association hopes to maximize profits for our producers, feedlots, packers, and retail and food service clients by increasing the demand for beef. To date, the American Akaushi Association has registered nearly 100,000 Akaushi influenced cattle. We invite every rancher to visit our digital beef page, which is akaushi.digitalbeef.com. You can search EPDs, different members, or look at pedigrees that you think might fit your operation goals or needs. For the last 15 years, I, I have yet to have a bad steak that, that's an Akushi and does all the things, all the research says we, the industry needs. The, the Akushi cattle are, and I've, I've looked at the Angus program, I've looked at about every program everywhere in the world, the only genetics that can eliminate the select and have the prime are the Akushi cattle. So to start from that beginning and to grow a breed of cattle that was really new to the United States, over the period of time, we call it the American Akushi. We're developing a breed of cattle that works in, in the United States in a Western Hemisphere type environment. And today, you find our product in major retailers uh, across the country, as well as a lot of restaurants and grocery stores. Our goal and what we feel like from where we are today, in 10 years from now, I feel like you'll see Akaushi beef being asked for as the number one premium beef in the United States. If you'd have told me 10 years ago that we'd be selling 500 bulls a year, I might not have believed you. But we are selling 500 full-blood Akaushi bulls a year. The Akaushi breed has become mainstream. So I feel the consumer is going to continue to want premium, high-quality beef. And Akaushi puts you in the driver's seat to produce that great beef, that super high-end premium beef that the consumers are demanding. 
The demand is greater than any of us can keep up with at this point. So there's tons of room for more breeders to come in, whether it's seed stock or F1 breeders. We hope you enjoyed our story on Akaushi cattle. To find out more about us, visit our website, theamericanrancher.com, or connect with us on Facebook. I'm Pam Minnick for our entire American Rancher team. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time. with 44 Farms. We have a new program with Walmart called Prime Pursuits, which brings together great Angus producers from around the United States together to provide great beef for the consumer. Producers all around the country, we would love for you to, to join us in this great pursuit. So please give us a call. We would love to talk to you about the specifics of this great new program. Thank you.